All right, we're going to be working with um, finding reference angles using inverse trig ratios. So if we look at what we've already got, they've given us the fact that the sine of theta is equal to negative 0.5592. So what we are going to do is we're going to go ahead and say that the sine of theta is equal to point five five nine two because we know that the trig ratio of any given angle if they are coterminal differs only in sign so we're, we're dropping the negative so basically we're saying that that's the the absolute value there and so in order to find theta hat which is associated with this sign up here we're going to do the inverse sign of 0.5592. That's going to give us 34 degrees. And so because that is theta hat, what that tells us is this. Really what we're working with is a reference angle. And up here we are given the parameters for the reference angle. So it's going to tell us where it is. So if we go ahead and put this where it belongs in quadrant three so we're going quadrant three with this guy and if we go ahead and label it the reference angle is 34 degrees and if it's in quadrant three that means that this angle here is the 34 degrees and so what that tells us is this if we do the 180 degrees of that arc plus the 34 degrees that we have additionally, we get that it's 214 degrees. Now 214 has the same sign as the reference angle of 34 degrees, but it fulfills both parameters that is in quadrant three and it's between zero and 360 degrees.